guys, um, so I'm going to do my favorite spring nail polishes. So I got a whole little bin, like this, full of them. So, yeah, I just did this hair tutorial, so if you want to go check it out, um, it's really cool. So I hope you guys like it. Um, so I'm going to start with my favorite nail polish in the whole universe. And I love it for spring, I love it for winter, I love it for summer, I love it for any time of the year. So I even, like, I loved it so much I got two of them. That's how much I loved it. So it's this one right here. And if you want to know what it's called, it's called Kaleidoscope. And it's from Wet n Wild, Wild Shine. And seriously, it's the best glitter ever. I'm not even joking. Like, if you can see this, it's, like, up to here. That's how much I used. So I had to get another one. That's my first nail polish I ever used, the whole thing. Amazing. Amazing, amazing, and if you want to know, like, the top, it's 460D. So that's that. The next one is from When Wild Mega Last, and this one's in Sugar Coat. I love to do, you know, French manicure like I have right now with this color. This is a really nice color to, you know, use, it, use as a nude, and it's a really, like, nudie pink color and it is just gorgeous really pretty spring color i love this red this is my favorite red in probably like the universe so far um this one's from nyc and it's in madison avenue and it's just a normal red but it matches with my skin tone and it's just extremely pretty so i just have to love it so yes there's more then there's this nude from mark Wins. This nude, it came in a package of eight, and there were they had no names, but um, yes, on the ba on the bottom of it, it says twelve. I'm not sure if they all say it, but yeah, they all say it. But it's like a really pretty nude, and if you go on Markwins, I think you can buy it. I think it was like twenty dollars for the whole set. You get a nail dryer and everything. So I just love this nude. It has a bit of sparkle to it, and it's just so pretty. So that's another favorite nude. This is probably my favorite pink in the whole universe right now. It's very light pink. And again, it's from Mark Wins. Um, It's pink. It came in, like, the set that I was just talking about. This pink has so much glitter and is perfect to just put on top of a manicure. Like, it's so faint and it's so beautiful. It's like someone hired a Barbie or something or fairy in town and just glittered up your nails. My favorite turquoise in the whole universe right now, especially for spring, is Essie's Turquoise and Caicos. Turquoise and Caicos, it is so pretty. It's not even funny. Seriously, really pretty. Love this color, and it just matches every skin tone. I really like it. Another one that does not have a name. This is green, and it's from NYC, and there's no name at all. Nowhere, already checked, um, but there is like a little code thingy right here, and it says 110, so 110A, and it's this green, it's kind of like really pretty, kind of fairy green, it's really pretty, it's kind of like a Tinkerbell green, it's really pretty though. Another cool blue to wear is this one from, it's called Pacific Blue, and it's from the Sally Hansen Extreme Wear Collection. And it's just a really pretty color when you look at it. And it's like bluish, purplish. It's not just your normal blue. So, so far this OPI nail polish, um, I've been loving. I'm not sure really what it's called. It's called La Pazivitaly Hot. I'll probably put it like right here or something. But um, I'll write it in the down bar for sure. But seriously, I don't really know how to pronounce this very well. But it's beautiful color. I have it on my toes right now, seriously, with, like, another color. But seriously, it's really pretty. Like, seriously, really pretty. Oh my god, my camera fell. Really pretty, though. Really pretty color. And that's from OPI. This one's from China Glaze, and uh, this, is my, this was my first China Glaze I ever bought, and seriously, it's amazing. I love it. And this one's in shocking neon pink. Pretty, really pretty. It is the prettiest color on the whole universe. I think I said that for every one of them. But seriously, this one is really pretty. It's so shocking. It's so pretty. Why don't you just say both? 
So the next thing, um, from Sally Hats at Hot as Nails, and I got it, like, a long time ago, but this one's in glazed sand, and it's so pretty, like, I want to show you guys, I'm going to open it for you guys. I haven't used this one in, like, I don't even know, but it's really, really, like, a satin color. Really pretty, though. It was about to drip. So this is a really pretty color. I love it. Second, lastly, this is probably my favorite, like, glitter red. Glitter, not favorite, like, red color. But this is my favorite glitter red. This is from Nicole by OPI. And this one's in OMB. So, O-M-B. So this is a really pretty red color. And it has a whole bunch of glitters in it. And it's just really pretty just for the spring. And it's just a nice change. Lastly, this is, I got this from Walmart. I'm not sure you can, if you can get this anywhere. This is my Pro FX, and it's, um, base coat. I've been loving this so far. This is, like, $4, and look how big it is. Like, that is, like, look at it compared to a normal polish. That is sick. Look at that. So, this base coat, just practically, you put it under your nail polish, and it's just amazing. Like, I really like the brush and stuff. But it's, like, in in general, it's awesome. Seriously, though. It, like, really... A lot of base coats say that they'll protect, but they don't really protect everywhere. But I've been using this one for about two months, and I just absolutely adore it. So I hope you guys like my spring favorites. Um, obviously, I had not very much of them. But obviously, I will get some more, like summer ones, winter ones, fall ones, stuff like that, and I just hope you guys like it. Um, I will probably do a nail tutorial soon, like an actual nail tutorial, because my nail, like, section is kind of getting full. Like, there is so many of them that it's getting practically impossible to not do a nail tutorial. I probably will do a nail tutorial in about two days, so I hope you guys just like this video and everything about it. Bye guys!